guys, welcome back to my channel, it's Giovanni Soleil. Welcome if you're new and welcome back if you're not. Today is gonna be a really special video. It's going to be a sneaker video. The reason why I'm doing another sneaker video is because my last sneaker video that I did, it did really well. It got like 7,000 views or something. And I know that's not, that's not a lot to some of y'all, but that's a lot to me. But like I said, I decided to do another sneaker video um, because I feel like I feel like I need to base my channel around like what I do and sneakers is what I do. I live, breathe, and sleep sneakers. My life revolves around sneakers. So I feel like I need to base my channel around what I do for a living, which is sell sneakers. So I'm gonna start doing that. And also I'm gonna base my channel around like more fashion because it's what I like to do. Those are the videos that bring me the most audience. So I think I'm gonna start doing that. So if you see a change in my videos and you don't see any vlogs or any or as much vlogs, then that's why. But yeah, anyway, let's just get started with the video. Okay, so I'm going to start with, I have them in order. I have 13 pairs of sneakers that I've gotten over the last, I would say, couple months. I don't know the exact like number of months, but I've had them for a little bit and I usually let them accumulate um, throughout the months so I can do just one full sneaker haul instead of just doing separate sneaker hauls. So I'm going to start with the Nikes first and I know Jordan is Nike, but you get what I'm saying. So I'm going to start with the Nikes first and most of the Nikes I have right now are Dunks, so that's what we're gonna start with um i have three pairs of dunks and then one pair of waffle ones so i'm just gonna go ahead and get started with it so the first pair of dunks that i have are a pair that i've been wanting for a long time ever since they came out and i wasn't able to get my hands on them so my boyfriend found them for me and i got them and they're a beautiful shoe they are a nike dunk low and this these are the nike dunk low coast and this is what they look like just the unc colorway but they have yellow as you can see on the aglets and then the nike sign on the on the um, tongue and then at the back they have the yellow with the nike and i just love this shoe so much because of the detail the detail on the shoe is amazing even the inside of the shoe is yellow so i really like these and like i said i've had these shoes for a couple months now so i have worn them i wear my shoes except for like three pair but yeah, these are the Nike Dunk Coast, and I really love these. I feel like I can style these with anything. I, I could definitely wear these shoes with this right now. So, oh, yeah, that's the first shoe. The next pair of shoes I have are a pair of the Nike Dunk Highs and Women. Um, these shoes are gorgeous. I love these shoes. Shout out to Bird Brain. If you don't know what Bird Brain is, follow them right here. I have their Instagram right here. Um, they definitely helped me out with these shoes and I appreciate that so much. So what we have here are, hold on, let me get the laces right real quick. You know me and my laces. I never have them right for these kind of videos. These are the aluminum dunk highs in women. They just look like this. They're just this pretty periwinkle color. They are really, really cute. Also really comfortable. Um, they have been worn. And when I saw these, I had to have them. A lot of people don't like dunk highs, but me personally, I like dunk highs. I said it, I don't care. I really like dunk highs. Um, I don't know why a lot of people don't, but I guess. Next pair of dunk highs I have, I just got recently and I haven't worn them yet, but these are the, and these are in grade school too. These are in women. Navy and white dunk highs in grade school. And they're just literally navy and white. That's why they're called navy and white dunk highs. But they look like this. Um, I really like this shoe. It fits really well. And yeah, there was a lot of um, late shipments on these. But again, Bird Brain helped me out for this one. So shout out to y'all. But yeah, like I said, I haven't worn them yet. I don't know what I'm going to wear with them. Because I don't really have anything in my closet that is navy. 
so I'm excited to see what I pull off but yeah these are the Nike deck highs in navy and white and then the last pair of Nikes are some Nike waffle ones um funny story on these I actually didn't mean to get these I bought these by accident and I know y'all are like how do you buy shoes by accident but I was at my store and I was trying to get another pair of shoes the same pair but in a different color and I accidentally grabbed this color I guess I didn't look at the color code correctly so these are the Nike waffle ones in the colorway active fuchsia and university gold they're just pink and gold and they are really cute and I haven't actually wore these yet um, I got them at a really good price I think they were like $30 or something but this is what a Nike waffle one looks like um, the next colorway I would probably get is the white and cream one, but these right here are really cute. I just decided that this would be a nice work shoe, so I just picked it up. And why not, because they were only like $30. So yeah, I really like these. Okay, so for the next pair of shoes I'm going to show you are my Jordans. Um, I have mostly ones that I've gotten over the time. So I'm going to show you those first and the first ones that I pick up are some women's Jordan 1 highs retros. These right here are so freaking cute. Um, at first I didn't like them. Um, the mock-up pictures were not that good but I seen them in person and I definitely had to get them. So these are the Jordan 1 high sea foams and they just look like this they're really 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 pretty like mint i guess mint like pastel muted color and white and they're so freaking gorgeous like look at this and they had different laces to begin with in the top of them but i took them out i feel like if you have a white tongue you're supposed to put white laces in them so i put white laces in them and they definitely do look better than the other ones that i had in them but they just look like this and they come with the hang tag too i took it off though because it was annoying me and i didn't want to lose it so yeah this is what the jordan one sea foams look like they're really cute really comfortable and yeah i also forgot to let you guys know what size i wear um i am a women's seven or seven and a half and that is equivalent to a five and a half or a six in grade school so that i just showed you were a size seven in women so yeah that's just for reference if you were wondering okay the next pair of shoes i have are another pair of ones and these are the shadow 2.0s and i actually forgot i had these until i was looking through my sneakers for this video and I know that's really bad but but yeah these are just gray and black and if you know what the original shadows look like this is just the reverse of them I guess original ones are the leather and they have gray right here instead of black but this is like a new buck so yeah they're just like kind of reverse but they are called the Jordan 1 high retro shadow 2.0s and these are really cute really easy shoe to match with and to coordinate and yeah and i decided to get this shoe because i don't have the original shadows and this is the closest thing i'm going to get to original shadows because i'm not paying what they want on go <laughs> i'm not but i do love the original shadows so yeah next pair are a pair of jordan retro lows these are actually my first pair of retro lows um, I've never had a pair ever in my life and thanks to the love of my life Mari he got them for me This is just what they look like. They're a neutral They're called the neutral gray Jordan 1 lows They just look like this um, a lot of people don't like the lows But me personally, I love them and the reason why I wanted this shoe is because of the neutral color to it so instead of wearing like an Air Force one you could just grab these and throw something on real quick with them and I feel like this is a good everyday shoe they're pretty cool so shout out to you Mari Thanks. I keep sitting on my hair and it's really annoying me sorry guys the next pair of ones that I got of course you can tell by the box if you know you know these are the pollen ones it had a lot of hype to them 
and this is just what they look like they're just black and yellow really good colorway to have in your collection they just look like this and the tongue looks like that i put the yellow laces in them because i thought that it would be cute and it is but it does come with different laces it comes with a white pair and a black pair and i don't know i think the black pair would just like take away from the yellow in it so i just decided to put the yellow laces in them and that was a good choice so like i said these are the pollen ones grade school size five and a half and then the last pair of ones that I have are the, I don't even know, honestly, I would be forgetting which ones I have. But, okay, so these are the Electro Orange Jordan 1s. Um, they're just white and orange, and they look like this. Put two different laces in them, the orange and the black laces, just to give an effect. I do that sometimes with my shoes. But this is what they look like with the orange laces. They're just a white back and, and then the toe box is white and then right here is black. And the part right here is like this metallic uh, orange color and they match my nails, of course. But a lot of people didn't like this part, but I think it's cute. I don't know. But yeah, these are the Electro Oranges and the bottom is orange. And yeah, I think they're pretty cute. Okay, moving on to the other shoes that I have. Um, these first ones I actually got in today. They came just a minute ago, and I'm really happy that they came. And these are a pair of Jordan 1 Lows. And some of you aren't going to like these, but me personally, these are cute. I think they're cute. So, these are the Teddy Bear Jordan 1 Lows, and they just look like this. Let me focus it for you guys they just look like this and obviously they're inspired by a teddy bear so they're fuzzy and these are a great fall slash winter shoe even the laces are fuzzy and the swooshes have different colors on them so on this side it's blue and then this side it's like this pink color and then on the other shoe we have the red swoosh and then this like lime green swoosh for the teddy bear jordan ones um i really like these like i said i just got them a minute ago so yeah these are really cute i don't know i like them they're pretty cool and i feel like they're gonna be worth something in a while so i just decided to grab them next pair are a pair that you can tell what they are by the yellow box these are the jordan 4 lightnings and this shoe is a beautiful shoe. I love this shoe so much. Are the Jordan 4 Lightnings. Um, they're just a yellow shoe with gray accents and also black accents. These are a really cute shoe. I love them so much. Really, really cute. Can't wait to put on an outfit with them. And all of my fours, I get a size six because they do run really small. If I got a five and a half, my feet at work would be literally on fire. I couldn't stand up anymore if I got a five and a half. So I got a six and yeah. Next pair are a pair that I've been wanting since February and I could not get my hands on them because I could not find them in my size anywhere. None of the stores in my area had them so I couldn't grab them. And of course, sneakers app. It was the L on sneakers app. When I tell you this is my favorite shoe of all time, I feel like this is an essential shoe for you to have in your collection because of the color. Are you guys ready? Let me just pull them out real quick for you. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh. Here they are. These are the taupe fours and they are just a gorgeous 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 shoe i love the detailing on this shoe as you can see there's like crackling going on at the top and the color of it is just an amazing color um, it ties in really well with the infrared color at the tongue and also the inside of the tongue these are an essential shoe for you to have in your collection because it's a neutral color it's a taupe color when i got them i was like this is going straight to the toe i don't care i don't care i paid more than enough for these but yeah as i was saying this shoe is an essential for you to have in your collection i love this shoe so freaking much it is so cute 
and I cannot wait to style it. This is definitely my favorite shoe in this haul at the moment, so yeah, these are the taupe fours. And these shoes were like a last minute decision. I just decided to get them because I only have one other pair of threes and I needed another one. And also the colorway is a pretty good colorway. So I got them the other day and this is what they look like. These are the Jordan 3 Pine Greens and they are just the pine green color and then they have the ele elephant print on them. And then the only part I don't like about this shoe, honestly, is how they put yellow right here. I don't know why they did that, but I guess. But yeah, these are the Jordan 3 Pine Greens and they're pretty cute. They look really good on foot. I can style these so many different ways. And yeah, like I said, I just decided to grab them. It was like a last minute decision, so. Yeah, these are pretty cool. Pine green threes. Okay guys, that is all for my sneaker haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also, if you're not subscribed by now, what are you doing? We go through this every time. If you're not subscribed by now, hit that subscribe button and join the family so you can see more sneaker videos. Make sure you guys leave a comment down below saying which of the pairs were your favorite in this haul, like you always do. Hope you guys have an amazing day, and stay safe. Um, wear your mask, wash your hands, all of that, and yeah. And I will see you guys in my next video.